small mishap in uh, turn one, we, we tuck the front, so starting fifth on the grid, uh, it's quite a good result coming out second. Uh, Mick Blair rode really well in the race, we were pushing each other down to uh, the fastest times anyone's been over the weekend, so I'm really happy to get on the podium and hopefully we extend the lead in the championship. How important was that fantastic start in that race? Oh, the start was, was great, I've been practicing on my R6 on the road, under 100 kilometers an hour, I might add. Uh, uh, so <laughs> I've got the, the starts down pat and it really paid off then. I didn't get caught up with the slower riders. I was able to, actually able to show what I've got. Well done, mate. Congratulations. Cheers, Phil. First one this morning, calm before the storm. That was a pretty hectic race. Looked like it was a pretty lonely one for you, though, in, uh, in third place for the, pretty much the entire race after a bit of a battle early. Yeah, um, I didn't get the best of starts again and trying to bridge that gap to... Daniel and Mick, it uh, paid a bit of toll on the tyre, but the bike worked well. I seemed to be consistent all the way through and uh, finished third. So, yeah, good ride by the other two. Second overall for the round, how important is that for your confidence going in through to the next round? Yeah, that's great. Um, we've got a little bit of testing to do and hopefully we can find some speed back and Pirelli tyres will work awesome there again, I hope. Congratulations, mate. Well done. Thank you. Michael Blair, you didn't qualify on pole position, but that uh, all pales into insignificant. Oh, you did qualify on pole position, so it's a perfect weekend for you this weekend. Um, yeah, you know, we're stoked. Yeah, um, yeah, two race wins and the first time on a super sport bike, so yeah, couldn't be happier. Now, as we said, uh, you didn't qualify on pole position because you're on the inside of the uh, the grid. Seemed to work pretty well for you on all of those starts, and getting away to a good start seemed to be very important this weekend. Um, yeah, definitely. You know, having that inside, I could get the jump, and even if I didn't have it on them, I could squeeze up the inside and try control the race. But yeah, no, it didn't couldn't go any better. I just like to thank all my team, you know, all my sponsors, and everyone just helped out. It was awesome. What did you think when Daniel went past you halfway through the race? There was uh, any change in strategy? Um, no, nah, not at all, you know, we just tried to keep a cool head and yeah, I knew I could outbreak him. I was out a bit, a bit later and I knew the tyres would come into a play a bit, so yeah, the Pirellis were working awesome and we could get, get the win. Now you've been going overseas, doing a bit of racing, when's the next uh, journey overseas for you? Um, we head off to India in um, three weeks, I think, for the round three of the Asian Road Race Championship, so yeah, can't wait. Can't wait to keep up with it on Instagram. Well done, mate, congratulations for a fantastic weekend. Yeah, cheers, thank you.